My first Diamond CBD review. We've got the Chill Extreme Blend Gummies, 25 milligrams per gummy. I think that says 15 milligrams of Delta 9 THC and 10 milligrams of HHC. So I've never bought anything from Diamond CBD because I didn't think their prices were that good, but they had a BOGO or a 40% off, which I found out is most of the time. So I picked this up for about $45. For $45, you get 1,000 milligrams, but I've noticed that 1,000 milligrams is not like, you know, going to the dispensary and getting some solid, good, expensive gummies. 10 milligrams there will do me good. I did 75 milligrams last night, and I felt pretty fucking awesome. Now... You get blueberry, raspberry, and what is it? Blueberry, raspberry, and strawberry. But there's really not a, oh, oh yeah. You can kind of see the difference. The blueberry and the raspberry look identical, which is impossible to tell. So the price was pretty decent. <clears throat> I'm gonna give the price an eight out of 10 for a thousand milligrams. Uh, what is this? 40 gummies. So, you know, about a dollar a gummy. I can live with that. Sometimes it's more expensive, sometimes it's less. Especially if you get BOGO, then it's a pretty good deal. The flavor, they're gummies. They're big fat gummies. They're pretty decent. Usually, like for example, last night, you know, I don't take a whole lot of edibles, but last night getting through one of these, another one of these, and half of one of these, I wasn't like grossed out, but I also wasn't like excited to do it either. They're just standard, standard flavor, you know, five out of 10, nothing special, nothing super crazy. I had a mushroom chocolate bar the other day, the whole fucking thing or half the whole fucking thing. And it tasted wonderful. And these, you know, maybe I'm just not a gummy guy, but I got a bunch of these gummies. You know, I've had a lot of gummies. I've had some real bad ones, some real good ones. And these are right in the middle. So I'm going to give that a five out of 10. Now let's talk about the effects. So I've noticed that their Delta 9 is not as potent as like regular traditional THC from a dispensary. So the 15 milligrams is like, eh, okay, whatever. Plus 10 milligrams of HHC. I've got an HHC cart right here. This is the dopest cart, not a huge fan of it. And you know, it's a different experience. So when you combine the two in edible form and you take two and a half of them, you're in for a pretty decent ride. I felt really good. I was super stoned all fucking night and I felt great and they were pretty cheap and they didn't gross me out to eat. So the unique blend of 15 milligrams of Delta 9 and 10 milligrams of HHC, you know, they worked har harmoniously. Har they worked in harmony pretty well. I was sufficiently fried, uh, really good, really fried, like taking a couple big fat dabs off two and a half. Everybody metabolizes these different, but you know, there's no indica or sativa specific effects going on here. It's a nice hybrid, nice in the middle. My wife got them to sleep, but they actually make her have a lot of energy and go crazy. So she stopped taking them. Uh, and you know, for me, it's just like a nice, decent hybrid with a good body load, but I still feel like I could go around and do stuff. Usually when I rip into these things pretty hard, you know, I'm stoned for the first 30 minutes when they kick in. And then I just kind of want to wander around the house and do things and talk to people and, and and text people and call people and, and do shit like that. So these are good if you just want to get in a good mood for cheap without getting raped on the taxes at the dispensary. This is a solid option from Diamond CBD. I would recommend them. They're definitely not my favorite gummies I've ever had. My favorite gummies are actually from a dispensary in a local company, so I didn't review those because I figured nobody gave a shit. But I like to talk about the online stuff that you can get federally legal and this is included. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I enjoy these gummies, definitely recommend them, but it's not the best I've ever had. If you have something that you think I would like better, let me know in the comments below. And that's fucking it, baby.